Quadruple feature! This will be the last video of the session, though, barring some, I don't know, real craziness on my part. We still have the Enigma down there. It's doing wonderfully. It's a beautiful game. Ah, oh, man. I have a little bit of stock developed for it. That's fine. Be nice to have a little bit on hand. Eventually there's going to be a Christmas sale or something. It'll be more in demand. Uh, let's go ahead and check to see how History is a Call sold. Not bad. Could have been a lot better, though. Might actually not turn a profit. It's only an 8 out of 10 game. Lords and Ladies 2 is just now getting to the point of turning a profit. That's okay, because I have over $500 million, folks. I'll, I'll, I'll be okay. And with so many, you know... Enigma, Enigma is available now. People don't know what to do with themselves. No, I want good quality non-Windows games. Nintendo 64. You know what? Sure. The damn platform was retired. I'll do it anyway. Just to say I did. That was me. I did that. Am I not awesome because of my actions that I, I took here on this day? Okay. Publisher, are you doing anything you're not supposed to? No, you're good. You're kosher. Good. Expect no tofu is on the process of the, working on that there. I might make some more units of things. Harlot, I think it's time to get all these units out of the inventory. So there you go. We'll put them on the market. Get some more Trail of Tears out there. In two weeks might be needed. Nah, I'm good. I don't need that license. I'm doing a fantastic job the way it is. And my people are busy. Where is the Trail of Tears? There we go. Am I looking here on units? Doing alright. Doing alright. Monopoly? Nah. Two in one pack? Nope. 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 Oh, ready to rumble boxing, 6 out of 10 for the Game Boy Color, and 36% of the sales? You have yourself a deal. How may I assist you on this fine, fuzzy, wumpkins day? You know what, let's get some more publishers. I know this is what you've all been waiting for, folks. More hot and exciting publishing action. I'm gonna do it. It's gonna happen. Will you take... 17,000. You will. Great. Now I'll hire the most qualified people. How about 15,000 for you to help me publish? How about... No, you're not interested at all. I see. Okay, well. 8,500. Time for there to be a significant drop in the amount of money people will make. I'm okay with that. Check out the publishing department. Ah, let's go ahead and get another person. One more person. Said publisher. Damn it. A. Green. Great name, bro. Okay. 20,700 units. Good, good. Not the most that, you know, the top publishers will make, but that's okay. And we are Apparently, very low on stock of these damn enigmas again. Who knew? Games released for the platform, 1,476, and I'm not all the way through with this deal at all. Still have 150 left. Nope. Uh-uh. Gonna be picky about this shit, because I can. Game Boy Color? Ah, sure, why not? How much of a difference is it really making that I no longer really release published games for my competitor? I don't know, but it makes me feel better as an individual. <laughs> oh, man. Super powerful machine. Ah, uh, nope. Ah, uh, cats, your computer pets. Tempting. Fine, it's a 6 out of 10. Fine. They got me, everyone. They got me with a deal. Those sons of bitches. I am nearly done with the Enigma 3D modes. No. I'll take care of this. Seven weeks left? Yeah, I suppose that was the best line. No. Nah. 
Six out of ten. Fine. These percentages and the high enough quality games, they're getting me, everyone. Those bastards. How could they? Well, I got a lot of stock of you. We have had another price drop, though, so... 1,000. And these... These numbers are totally glitching out. What matters is that we've made over $702 million from this console. Which is definitely paid for everything, folks. It is definitely paid for everything. My credit line is slowly growing as well. That's nice. And if we go to hardware sales, I'm definitely uh, at the top there now. My sold number is continuing to climb. The fifth most sold console in the history of the video game industry. Also, those guys did finish. And uh, just to make sure this is what you're going to be doing, go ahead and do that. I'm going to need you people later. I won't fire you, though, because I will need you later. You'll be good for me. And I'll be good for you. Okay. No, no, no. Unreal Tournament? Nah. Revolt for the PlayStation? Sure, that's a console. That's not a direct competitor to me. can be interpreted to be a competitor, but I won't interpret it like that. Logical? That seems logical enough. Beautiful. Hardware lines are, well, hard at work. Warehouse storage, I got a ton of it. What of it? Uh... Expect no Tofu 3 coming out next week. Deja Vu 1, 2. Oh, like a, a double package deal. Yeah, sure, I'll be responsible for that. What the hell, why not? And I keep trying to reserve a publisher because I'm thinking I'm going to be publishing these games when I'm not. I might want to load up for the Christmas sale, though, just in case. Let's get some more, uh, a bit more Trail of Tears in there. I want to go on autopilot with this shit. I do, I do, I do. I'm not autopilot, just, you know, not having to think about it anymore. The Naval Wars 4 being the final one there. Uh, who's the best? I can't sort like that. Is it Nintendo of America again? It is. Nintendo of America is publishing all of my games, everyone. Fantastic. That's just in time for Christmas sales. Good news! Cycle through these on our way back down to the Enigma. And that has not been cracked yet. Okay. Well, let's get another game out. We gotta go through all these, folks. Space Puzzles 2? Nah. Horrifying Cooking Total War? The old books coliseum ah uh, yes it is 1999 all right we'll make some new memories everyone it's gonna be a role-playing game set in medieval times so like lords and ladies basically you know we'll have this be nah 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 maybe i won't develop that one let's see here what's What's view genre demand like? Simulation game, super high. Okay. I can do that. Simulation, managerial. No special effects, brilliant. Without special effects, brilliant. So it doesn't have to be. It can be a... Uh... Oh yeah. Oh, this is happening. Fuck the list. Oh, this is happening. This has definitely been noted a few times by people before. Tank. Suit. Done and done. For those of you unfamiliar, uh, it's a Star Zoo reference. Tank suit. Everyone's a winner with tank suit. Everyone's a winner. 
How about we decrease this even more? We're gonna go into the triple digits. My god, not the triple digits. Oh yes, the triple digits. Software and hardware demands, very good. Yes, yes, yes. Should have enough copies of everything, probably except for the Enigma Wars. Let's go ahead and make some more of that. I'm gonna be putting that on budget pricing very soon as well. Like, oh, I'm out of copies again now, huh? Just go ahead and, nah, we won't increase the price. I'm a great guy. We'll keep it down there. Windows Fatty Bear's Birthday Surprise. That was a 6 out of 10 game. I decided to do it. I probably didn't need to make that many copies of it since it's not selling anymore now, huh? Now I feel stupid. Not the first time. Well, shit, everyone. Nope. Nah. Good game? Good game. Windows 3... Yeah, sure, fine. Windows 3.x. Whatever. <laughs> you want to publish it for that. You can do that. For 828 million employees getting certified insufficient copies of Expect No Tofu 3. Really? Well, yeah. Why the hell not? You go, Expect No Tofu 3. You go. Go where I don't have to manage you. Let's make a word? Yeah, sure, fine. I think, don't think I have to micromanage anything anymore. <laughs> Which is great, because that means I can just fast forward through time. I have a lot of time pass. I don't think any more of those units are going to be selling so much that I'm going to run out. Oh, wow! 7 out of 10? Yeah. It was for the Game Boy Color. I'll take it. No. No. Uh-uh. Civilization Call to Power? Yeah. Nope. Nope. My spelling words. Go for it. What the hell? Why not? Uh, nah. Math Workshop? No. Three Dirty Dwarves? No. Four Wheel Thunder? Yeah, sure. Let's go for it. And of course, the Enigma itself has vanished off the list. That's that's very bad game. I'm gonna have to put all products out now. Just so I can find this thing. Hardware cost six six six. We're building up a stock again. Let's remind everyone of the quality of the Enigma, shall we? In case they've forgotten, nineteen hundred and ninety five games released for it. They probably haven't forgotten. Lots of certifications, that's what all the email messages were. Anybody have any stocks they no? What am I looking at for share prices? You know what? Let's uh let's invest here. Let's have some fun. Why not? I don't really have to worry about Microsoft Game Studios being a major threat or anything, but what the hell? For for giggles. Let's own 45% of Microsoft Game Studios, folks. Hmm. I mean, this might end up, you know, they, they the stock market might go down for these things, but that's okay. You can't get a controlling you cannot get a controlling interest in everything, unfortunately. And 45% uh, is the maximum amount of anything you can hold. But thankfully, no one's, no one else has been able to afford shares of my shit. Oh, rather, they've been buying it. I mean, certainly it's still affordable, because I'm such a small company, everyone. Who well, has a lot of money out there in other companies, too. I could invest in Nintendo. The biggest one is Activision. Holy shit, that shit skyrocketed up there. It did. It went up the damn, out the damn roof, apparently. Sierra has apparently plummeted. Microsoft's been going up. 
Let's see, company. Activision Deutschland. Sony Computer Entertainment. I'm not sure whether I want to care about that or not. I want to buy anything else, you know? Microprose? Ah, eh, sure. Have some controlling interest in some other companies? What the hell? Maybe scare them with how much of their companies I'm buying? I have the money. Their companies might plummet over the passage of time. That's alright. I just wanted to invest everyone. Nope. Game Boy Color. I can accept that. Giant size booth, of course. Expect no Tofu 3, as published by Nintendo of America. Beats Castlevania. Apparently published twice for the Enigma. It was created two different times. Smurfs, Load Runner, Grim Fandango. Expect no Tofu. Got a top spot. It's beautiful. 6 out of 10. Fine. No, I don't want to publish it on my system. That takes effort. Taco Bell Tasty Temple Challenge for DOS? Sure. It's not really that much of a competitor. Video game sales are apparently going to be in trouble, everyone. Hope you're all ready for that. Oh, wow. Got a lot of stock now. Let's see whether we can change that. How's the hardware sales look? <laughs> Ah, oh, man. It is hot. As well it should be. Coming for you, everyone. Nearly 500... Excuse me. Sorry. I can't read. 5 million copies of that baby sold. Nearly 1 billion in profit. My god. Privateer 2 The Darkening. Yeah, it's a 6 out of 10. I'll publish it. Fine. Bastards got me. Yep, and my stock if that's going down now. It's good. Hellbender, yeah, sure. I only publish good games, everyone. Speaking of games, 2,110 of those released for the Enigma. That's right, bitches. Tons of games for everyone. And I'm out of stock again. Wait. <laughs> well, I'll just go ahead and uh, keep fast forwarding then until the game is ready for release. Yeah, sure. The game Boy Color. Minesweeper, no. 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 Taz Express for the Nintendo 64? Yeah, sure, why not? It's a dead system, but what the fuck? Come here, Nintendo of America. You're the best publisher for me. Tank suit. Go out there and do my bidding. It is the year 2000. We have 30 more years left in this game. It's crazy. Doing so much shit, everyone. 30 more years, too. We are not halfway. We are 40% done with this game, basically. Over one... Billion in profit. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's go ahead and make another game. See what we can do here. How are we looking here? Racing driving. Definitely did have suggestions for that, but I might make another sequel instead. I mean, we definitely got to ca capitalize on Harlot, so we'll go off with what Gaz plays suggested. This will be an adventure... Uh, what was it? Horror that it was? Yeah, horror. Why not? A horror. Perhaps puzzle solving's better if I can somehow squeak in some more... Nah, I can't. Can I squeak in some objects? I could. It's a brilliant game with these objects. Puzzle solving adventure game. With a lot of design required. Well, we've managed to fix that. It's gonna be an MMO as well, because what the fuck, why not? And so the subtitle for this, as Gazplay suggested, is Suck It Down. Harlot 2, Suck It Down. There you go, everyone. Hope you all enjoy. 
All right, 40 weeks. It'll be done uh, near the end of Christmas. Did I change that? I did change that. We have a lot of that shit left. I just want to keep releasing games, though. Oh, I have... If I run out of stock for things that might be selling, I don't know. Hmm. Well, I'm sure the game will tell me if I need more copies of something. Nah, I don't need more copies of anything. Looking at the warehouse doesn't look like it's changed at all. I'll keep those uh, on for another year, though. I'm not gonna... Maybe forever. I'm not gonna run out of space. Uh, bank. No, not bank. Stock exchange. What else can I get my hands into? Let me uh, buy some of the strategic simulations. Sierra Online has plummeted. <laughs> Microsoft Game Studios, Hudson Soft Company. You know, not that I can actually make a merger with anyone, but you know, I'm here. Soft Disk Publishing, what the hell, why not? Let's buy 45% in that. You know, not that this is doing anything other than, you know, perhaps giving me a potential profit of something by selling the shares, or it might give me a big loss. Basically just showing me that I'm investing my money, that I, I could be threatening these companies, maybe, with my actions. <laughs> I'll be looming over them. You know, always watching. That's something you can do, too, by the way. If you're really desperate, you can sell shares. You know, they shouldn't disappear. Yet. But corporate takeover is something that you do have to worry about. I think. Probably. <laughs> That's my definitive answer on the matter. Okay. Got major shares in that. What about infogrames? Infogr infogrames is doing okay. Go ahead and pour some money into that as well. Spreadsheet simulator doing things that don't exactly matter, folks. Well, because I have all this money, I might as well spend it on something. What the hell? Why not? Lucas Arts? Oh yeah. Should have bought shares of this shit sooner. As soon as I had all this money to do so. Just always be there, watching and waiting <laughs> for the time to strike. What about Capcom? Yeah, Capcom's doing all right too. Why the hell not? I have as many shares in these companies as I do in mine. Well, not me personally. It's really the entire company itself, Reaper Incorporated. All right, I've blown through the money. Time to just fast forward my life away. Troop. <laughs> you know what? Fine. I'll have my name attached to True Love. What the hell? Panzer General, though? No, it can get fucked. I know it was a 4 out of 10 game, everyone, but uh, I figured, why not for giggles? <laughs> uh, me got Tales from Heaven? Yeah, sure, why not? Manic Miner, 6 out of 10. These Windows games have to meet a higher quality unless their name greatly amuses me to publish. The other ones, though, only have to meet the 5 out of 10 requirement, basically. Lemmings, no. NBA Hang Time, Star Trek, NFL Blitz, Rune, Tiger's Honey Hunt, Mega Man X5, no. No, Roller Coaster Tycoon, Gold Edition, I have that. Steel Panthers, Panzer General 3, nope. Let me see some new deals. Dungeon Keeper plus Magic Carpet, get fucked. Livings, no. Zero Divide, uh -uh. This is what amused me, Battle Island Platinum for the DOS system. What the hell, that's what you want to sell it for. You can do that. Steve Baker has studied and got certified. Oh, yes. Yes, now the team is even bigger. Now it can even fit even more people. 
More hardware, people! <laughs> Glorious. Oh, well, let's lower our price even more, since we have so much of that in stock. A lot we have to look at there. It's a lot that needs to be sold off. Heaven forbid we just build up all of that stock of things. Hmm, are we going through it or not? Yeah, 7 out of 10 game? Sure, why not win? Doesn't look like we're actually doing that. I tell you what, guys. Right before Christmas. In case you forgot. <laughs> this is how awesome we are. Okay. I could have my guys try to do a major lowering of price here. Maybe we can put some more weeks onto it. This would be all fancy and shit. Maybe eight weeks instead of the standard four that we put on. Sure, sure, sure. Let's see how well that sells now. BAM! Not making as much profit off of it, but BAM! Gotta get it rid of that stock. Massive mountain of stock that we still have, and we are, we are going through with it. How does the, uh, how's it comparing here? Xbox! We still have the most powerful console on the market. The console computer on the market. Most powerful machine that you can get is right there. It is obtainable. It is a thing. Fourth most sales. Can I actually even touch the numbers of Genesis or DOS? Remains to be seen. There's quite a lot of piracy prevalent on the system. It's unfortunate. But it's gonna happen. Sift through. I don't think any other things are gonna be in concern. We have a lot of time between uh, games here. I might create another team. Uh, I might just do that. I didn't want to. I'm talking myself into it. Yeah, sure. It's a six out of ten game. Want to have my my name attached to you know good things. Monopoly, 6 out of 10 for the Game Boy Color, why not? I'm not making a new team, though, in this video. Sid Meier's Colonization! I'll do it for Windows, because it's Colonization. It was a 6 out of 10 win. Defender of the Crown? Yeah, I played that before on my channel as well. 6 out of 10, I concur. No. Not publishing that shit. Not publishing anymore. Can't make me. There we go. I've gone through my stock again. Also, my team uh, reduced the cost by $52. You guys did a good job, I guess. And I'm going to go ahead and increase the size of your team. How long is this video? Oh, yeah. We've got plenty of time. You all ready for me to hire some more people? Because that's what we're going to do. We're going to hire some cheap people. Some cheap hardware people who have talent. And we're going to have them studying. Do we have any 50 talents? We do. Do we have any... Oh, that's the, probably the cheapest one. Here we go. Talent of 40, and... Uh, we'll just have these guys, have these folks study. Now we'll sort by cost. Two. There we go. We're so smart, everyone. He has the technology and the power to make the world a better place. He can do it. He can rebuild you. He will renew you. He will make your life feel like living all over again. With the Enigma is not an enigma because it can do what oh, never mind <laughs> I I can't make any more out of that <laughs> all I do need to do though is keep filling this office space here because I got lots of it especially if well I am gonna go with three teams I suppose I can make a third team in this video 
I can get him started. I could have gotten him started sooner. I have so much money. Just keep working on it and developing games. Didn't know I wanted to manage that much. I've had a change of heart. Damn it. I have to hire a great... Maybe I'll make this a super expensive team, too. That costs loads of money, and it actually legitimately bankrupts the company. And then I'll sob profusely. And you all will laugh at my expense. I don't like this story. We need a better story. Alright, there we go. More people hired. Well, if I were theoretically going to do this, and I was going to say money is no object, who would be the best guy I could get? Victor Pence. Who could be the most talented guy I could get? Victor Pence. He could manage 41 employees. That would make a very strong second team. Damn it. Alright, Victor. My company seems a bit small and frail. What the fuck is wrong with you people? Do you not have eyes? Have you not seen how well the Enigma has sold? Do you not care? Are you foolish? You're definitely foolish. That's okay. Well, uh, you can't manage as many, and your flair for study is actually shit. Hmm. Let's try you out here. No. I was hoping I could sort by talent as well. That is unfortunate. No, I don't want that. Damn it, settings. As soon as you fucking go into that, uh, recruitment agency, it fucks with everything. Alright, Victor Print, uh... Pence doesn't want to play. So I won't do it this video, then. Do I want to keep going, though? Yeah, fucking stingy bastards are like, Nope, I'm unemployed and I'm gonna remain that way. $30,000 a fucking month is not good enough for me. <laughs> Come on. Come on, really? 30000 and 2000 That's not good enough for you? They're U.S. dollars, man. Come on. There are a few things I might do for $30,000 a month. <laughs> that I would not otherwise do. <laughs> You're not being sensible. <laughs> it's like, I'm insulted by your offer. It is the dumb. I'm like, really? Really, it's the dumb? Really? I suppose you'd actually, you're gonna rebuff me too. Yeah, try contacting you in a few months. Alright, yeah, I can't hire you. Talent's so bad. Yeah, okay. 29 employees, Douglas Eckert here. Will you accept 30,000? You will! Because you're smart. Okay. Uh. Ha. Huh. Talent. William R. Hewlett. You're pretty good at leadership yourself. That's true, you are. You're primarily a programmer. You are fairly experienced at it. I don't exactly need awesome leaders here. Well, let's start with you. <laughs> You're okay. You're currently between jobs at the moment. John Romero, come on in. You have a lot of studying to do, John. You have a lot of studying to do. Max, 20,000. Okay. No, 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 no. Alright, Tony Barnes has a lot of studying ahead of him as well. 18,000? Good. 
Nope, it was getting numb with how I positioned it. Damn it. Sales in the United States, by the way, are very bad. If only I cared. I'll fight through everything. Okay. Uh, here we go. This is the best guy left. As a talent that high. 18,500? Good. I fucking hired John Romero. I feel dirty now. <laughs> and I'm paying him a fistful of cash. Son of a bitch. Hate my life. Oh my goodness. Yes. All of my yes. Their studying can be made faster, naturally, if you know. I sped it up, I gave them the money to do so. The problem is, though, as you all know, it takes a lot of time to do in this game. And I'm not quite sure I want to fucking do that. Oof. Ooh. Costing me money and shit. Okay, let's get some graphics guys who have high talent and uh, have them begin the process of studying. Because I don't have to be in a hurry with this team. I can just relax. Take my time, take a load off my feet. They'll be great in the future. Have them do everything that uh, Team 1 currently cannot do because it's frantically working on, you know, video games and shit. It's fine. You know, this is not a super talented team. That's okay. No, no one's really tried to hire my employees away in a while. Maybe they know better? Maybe the game stopped trying to do that? I don't know. Okay, let's go ahead and get Russell Stark here for 9500 There we go. We'll get this team and uh, we'll make it work. Although I think their study time is up and that's why shit's so bad. All right, I've done the best I can do there. Who's the best I can do for ratings? I'll tell you what, how about rating four? We'll sort with that, and now we'll go with price. Peter Liepa, about 9,500. Say, so you fucking coders better come join my team. Don't be all like, your company is small, you, like this, all these assholes. Really? My company is small and frail? Burger Bill! About 15,000, Burger Bill. You made the right choice. You made the right choice. Scott Schramm! Ha! Ha! <laughs> we have a job for you again, Scott Schramm. We have a job for you. <laughs> Uh, I might have uh, actually rehired some other people too that I just didn't notice. Inter ah, fuck you. Don't care enough. Here we go. Let's get some price in and uh, let's pick off these guys who are worth five. Oh, I offered you way too much. Silly Grimoth. I highballed his ass. There we go. Mike Stewart. 85. I said 8,500, damn it. Gets 20 people on that team. This will be 21. Uh, he'll be number 22. Peter Ward. Doug Smith will be 23. Fucking bastards insulting me. Oh, you spoke company, doop, doop. <laughs> Study time. Get that shit down all the way. What could I possibly do with all of you? Alright. Damn it. Get to resort this shit again. 20, max rating. Minimum rating, 5. How about that? So I'm picking out the fives anyway. Okay, we got a lot of graphics potential here. Whew. Much harder to get that on this side. 
All the good guys have been taken. Bunch of program. Well, 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 huh. Minimum talent, 50. I'm going for all. Growth. Talent 60? Those definitely exist. They cost a lot. Ah. Sid Meier's still on the list. He can manage 29 employees himself, so I didn't exactly have to hire a specialist so I was going to hire him. Uh, John Carmack. Well, let's go with someone cheap, and we'll just have to do some development on him. Jeff Minter, you appear to be the cheapest person on this list. Alright. Will you take 27 grand? You will. Cool. David, will you take 26 grand? Good, I'm working it down. Herman Hilarith. You take 25,000? Okay, 26 then. Okay, no, 27? All right, fine. And uh, this will be a team full of a lot of potential, everyone. 29,000. Okay. Team is also going to be fucking expensive as all hell. I'm not looking forward to that. Anthony Tony Crowther? Oh, dick. 33,000. 34. Hooray! And we're done. No more hiring. Hurrah! And you are team... Uh, well, I suppose neither of you are that expensive. Uh, as expensive as these two. It's just... You have far fewer players. You are team... Uh... uh <laughs> Dai Katana. That is team Dai Katana, everyone. If John Romero's not a bad leader himself, just as a flair for leadership in this game. And all of you will now proceed to study for a week. And then I'm going to cycle through a turn? They're going to be dragging my finances, everyone. I suppose I am still making money hand over fist. And let's see how they're doing here with their study progress. Not bad. Douglas Eckert, I'm going to pay for you to study. There we go. Because you matter the most here. Everyone else, that's just going to take time. Oh yeah, Scott Schramm. I was like, why is there so much progress? I'll go ahead and cover your education course as well, Scott Schramm. Because I care. I care about you. You mean a lot to me. And we're going to go and release Harlot 2. And then we're going to go ahead and call this a video, everyone. Alright. Alright. I don't care about any of that, although I do have inactive production lines to how picky I am. I might have to publish my own game then, if no one wants to come get their game it's published by me. Yes, I had to pay much in the way of taxes. The tax man cometh. GameCube? Yeah, sure, why not? Xbox, Shenmue 2... New and more advanced 2001 bits platforms. Great. That means we all have to study. Even more. Because it broke down all of our statistics again, which means it's going to take Harlot 2 even longer to come out. Watch. Yep, that'll be fine. It suddenly stalled a bit. By much longer, I meant that. Tank Suit is the number one game, the best game of 2000. Sweet. Best selling games. Tribe's Action Pack is number one. Ha. Huh. Fish Files is fine with me. And. Uh, where are you? Where are you, Nintendo of America? You faithful publisher, you. You're doing a fantastic job. We're publishing in all the countries, even though some of it's not that great. And Harlot 2 Suck It Down goes on to the market, everyone. Hooray! Budget pricing. 
we'll take care of that. And that takes care of this quadruple feature. We've, uh, we've hired a second team. I've invested a lot of money into the stock market. I'm upgrading buildings because I can for the sheer thrill of it. I had to pay nearly 50 million in taxes. Fucking tax man, everyone. Fucking tax man. Enigma, I've sold all my stock of that. It's made 1.1 billion. Billion! And I've gone through a lot of in-game time. Sold numbers. Enigma is now the third best-selling computer. I keep calling it a console. It's a computer. In the entire history of the game. And it will only continue to sell more. DOS has been out for 16 years. And the Enigma is still has the greater the greatest specs on the market. Genius. Well, I could pay for these guys before I go for their research and shit they're studying. You can tell the good people cuz uh, they are flying through that shit fast. But you know, I can't find it within myself to care. Eh, takes time. There was a quick study all button, you bet my your ass I'd just constantly press that shit, but there's not. And you all have to get back to studying yourselves. Huh. I might start firing folks and replacing them with those who have a good flair for study or better. From that team. I really might. I think from this point forward, I only want people who have good flares for study. No matter, uh... I might actually end up even swapping out some folks with Daigatana that fuck the team chemistry, though. Like... I want the talent level to be at least 7. Or at least be 60. <sighs> Maybe. We'll think about it. Uh, it's gonna go ahead and take care of this episode, though, folks. My folks are gonna have to be busy studying, and... Busy studying. What does the future hold for me? I don't know. We'll have to see. I still actually do want to play more of this game, but I'm gonna force myself to stop and get some other stuff done. Besides... Oh. Ring of Crackers and Pirates was caught. Let's go ahead and check the Enigma one more time. Uh-huh. There we go. I've cracked the case. We're doing a good job.